Welcome in everyone, how you guys doing? If you guys inside there, hit that subscribe, like, share. We're not going to waste no time here. Firstly, I'd like to say is Happy New Year to each and every one of you. Yeah, um, the countdown begins now. So in advance, hope everyone's doing well, safe and ready for the festivities coming up in a few hours. Um, to each and every one of you who have subscribed to the channel, thank you. If you haven't already, just click that, click that button. Um, yeah, we're not going to waste no time. Women failed the WNBA. Bill Burr. I need to do some more reactions. So Bill, I've seen almost everything of his. But there's a few gems out there I have not touched on. So this is one of them. Let's go. I saw a woman a couple months back, professional soccer player, right? She goes on to ESPN or one of these sports channels, and she starts bitching, going like, I don't understand. How come female athletes don't make as much as male professional athletes? Before we right? continue, yeah, this is what I fucking love about Bill Burr. He does not give a flying f about the... I don't want to categorize... But, you know, the modern day mentality of you got to shut up and can't speak your mind or speak on certain topics. You want to call it the woke mentality or whatever it is. Yeah. Bill Burr don't give a. Yeah, y'all could come at him. You could try and cancel him. He cannot be canceled. He don't care. Fucking love Bill Burr. I'm pulling that right back. So we're talking about it. <laughs> don't make as much as male professional athletes. Hmm. Right? And all of these men had to sit there and act. Yeah, yeah. Going like, I don't understand. How come female athletes don't make as much as male professional athletes? Right? And all of these men had to sit there and act like they didn't know what the answer was. <laughs> they had to sit there like dumbfounded. Like, oh, I don't know. Why is that? <laughs> They're I afraid to speak. I have, I have no idea. <laughs> Let's Literally, go. I'm sitting at home screaming at the TV because you don't sell any fucking tickets. <laughs> Nobody is going to women's soccer games. You're playing in a 20,000 seat arena. 1,500 people show up. That's not a good night. Oh, shit. The promoter lost. 20,000 arena, 1,500 people turn up. Man, you're not even paying the fucking light bill and the rent. You, you know, <laughs> you talk about money, man. How about, how about keeping the stadium open, the arena open? 1,500 a night? Shoot, that's just covering certain bills, much less we're talking about paying. <laughs> Let's go. his fucking ass on that gig. <laughs> I'm not saying no professional female athletes, Serena Williams, the women in the UFC, you know? But nobody's hey, watching hey. your fucking... I love that. He said Venus, you know what I'm saying? And not just Venus Williams, any tennis play out there really kicking it hard, you know what I'm saying? But the women in the UFC, they need, yeah, yeah, they need, they, they need to get paid more. Even though they are getting, they need to get paid more because that's some serious sport. When I see women in the UFC, oh, I'll take my hats off like, yo, bruh. Ain't messing with her, you know. She's serious, serious. But yeah, no, I agree. I agree. Let's go. <laughs> the women in the UFC, you know, but nobody's watching your fucking sport. And then you're going to come and you're going to get mad at fucking men. They keep doing that shit. Why are you yelling at us? It's not our fucking job. It's not my fucking job to give a fuck <laughs> about women's soccer, okay? I have men's sport to pay attention to. This is, it's your bullshit. Right? <laughs> Dude, look at the WNBA. Dude, nobody in the WNBA got COVID. <laughs> nobody. <laughs> they have been playing in front of three to four hundred people a night for a quarter of a century. Oh shit. <laughs> Not to mention it's a male subsidized league. <clears throat> we gave you a fucking league. <laughs> None of you showed up. Where are all the feminists? That place should be packed with feminists. Faces painted, wearing jerseys, slashing their titties. <laughs> going fucking nuts like the guys do. In the upper deck with their big beard titties. Am I on the jumbo tron? Am I doing it? No. No. <laughs> yes, no. <laughs> none of you, none of you 
went to the fucking games. None of you. You all. You failed them. Hey. Not me. Not me. <laughs> Women failed the WNBA. Ladies, support ladies, your ladies, own. Support your own. Five all-time WNBA players of all time. Come on. That's it. Name five WNBA teams. Name a WNBA team in your fucking city. You can't do it. You don't give a fuck about them. They play night in and night out in front of nobody. It's a fucking tragedy. It's true, though. If you're going to complain about pay, which um, equates to how many people show up for a game, and then there's nobody showing up, for that league, it says a lot. And a lot of people out here are the ones arguing and making noise. Oh, yeah, women should be getting paid more in this sport. Yes, they should be getting more, um, what do you call it, deals um, outside the court or outside of um, the actual league itself, promotions, etc., sponsorships. But if none of you decide to go to support your own, how could we have this discussion? You know, like it goes for any kind of league or any kind of sport. If no one's going there to support it, how am I going to be the one to be cussing to go, yeah, but they're paying those players this amount. Yeah, it's not fair. Yeah, they in, in and day out. And it's like, yeah, though, but do you know how much it costs just to maintain and keep it running? Like, yeah, y'all need to get out and support your own some more. You know, get out and support your own. Then we could have these talks. So, but yeah, I know there's a lot more politics. I don't say politics, I say politics, because there's so many politics in it. But still, yeah, Bill Burr does not give a. <laughs> right? <laughs> and then, meanwhile, you look at the Kardashians, they're making billions. You know those Real Housewife shows? They're making money hand over fist. Because that's what women are watching. And the money listens. The you money want to watch this shit? You watch this shit. <laughs> they just shoot it over there. Drowning these whores in money. Oh, 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 shoes oh, oh, and Botox. It's just no. raining. It's raining money. Yeah. So, the money oh. listens. You'd rather watch that shit. Real housewives. Bunch of women just tearing each other down. Well, maybe that's why your husband left you. Baby, that's why your husband left. That's why you can't have kids, bitch. <laughs> that's why your ass is as flat as your titties, bitch, right? That's the message you sent. We would rather watch that than see a bunch of women come together as a, as a team and try to achieve the top goal. We'd rather watch them actually fucking destroy each other. And that says a lot about the world we're in today, and it's not just for female, that goes for everyone. We'd rather watch a lot of bullshit on social media, trending stuff where people are getting abused, um, jump, beaten up, um, robbed, etc. And first thing you're thinking as well too, like, who's they recording? You're not stepping in to help, but you rather record. But we rather watch a lot of that stuff than go and support sports, go and support players, go and support other charities or things that actually matter in everyday world, this is what we'd rather go give our time to. And you see how much hours people put into watching bullshit that could be put somewhere else to improve yourself. You know, it's, I, I totally hear what you're saying, man. Let's go. Yeah. It goes for everyone. No, no, no. And then in the end, you no, come no, no. back and you fucking yell at guys. Like, and it's like, all right, so let me get this straight. I have to buy you a drink. Stop the axe murderer from coming through the fucking window. <laughs> and I have to watch WNBA games for you? Like, when are you going to pick up your end of the couch? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I see no bullshit in that. I see no bullshit, no lies. No lies told here. Bill Burr. Yeah, we're going to do some more reaction to Bill Burr. Definitely. It's just, yeah, Bill Burr, you got I ain't censoring nothing. I'm speaking my mind. I don't care. <laughs> but a happy new year, everyone. Yeah, thank you for tuning in. And I will see you guys in the new year, 2024, coming up in a couple of hours. So, but be safe. No matter what you do, no matter how much you drink, no matter what party, wherever you go, most importantly, be safe. I want to see you in 2024. Thank you for tuning in and take care.